I'm never gonna be perfect at this game. Ain't nobody gonna be perfect. So just putting your head down and working every day, that's kind of the biggest goal for me. You know, I say I had great coaches, great teammates that helped me throughout the season, throughout my whole career. So, you know, listening to them, um, hearing all the advice they gave me. But we have the resources there. Like with Coach Mike Joseph, he's developed a lot of NFL guys. So I kind of leaned on him and uh, he's prepared me the right way. I'm glad I'm able to represent them and you know, my family in the state for sure. I'm getting like a lot of, you know, talk about being like a mid to, you know, late round pick, but I want to prove that I'm just as athletic and you're getting the exact same thing in, in me as you would in somebody in the first round or the second round just for, you know, more bang for your buck. Hey man, shout out to West Virginia, Mountaineers, man. I love y'all, man. All, endless support. I love you guys to death. You know, I spent five years of my life you know, at the university, so I, my, my heart is forever with you guys. And uh, I appreciate the coaches, uh, my, my teammates over the past years that you know got me to this point. You know, I, I love you guys to death. And uh, let's go Mountaineers. What's up, Mountaineer Nation? Uh, I'm at the combine, looking forward to you know putting on a show tomorrow. I uh, appreciate everybody's support. I haven't really been on social media, but I know that uh, the support is there. I kind of actually did predict this, but um, I was glad to put off West Virginia. Me and Dante did our thing here uh, on national television, you know. So uh, it was a good day overall. I feel real good about it, and um, I look forward to Pro Day in Morgantown at 27. Handle business today. Very blessed to be out here again. Uh, I don't know what to say at all. Like I'm, I'm mind blown right now. <laughs>